Introduction to CMake Part Three, the Binary Tree. Uh, today we're gonna I'm gonna show you Visual Studio, both VC6 and 2005. So for that we'll need to open CMake, GUI, and the first parameter is the source tree. In our case is CTemp demo and the binary tree. Let's call it build PC PC6. Click on configure, select PC6, finish. Let's set the install prefix to be the same as our binary tree or build tree. Click configure again and generate. That's it. Let's open our project. This is six. And you can see there are two uh, custom targets all build, which basically build all our binaries, and the install one, which is like build, but it's also performing the install. So what I'm going to do is just use the install and the debug version. You can see the four predefined version here, the release, mini size, release with debug info, and debug. In our case, I'm going to do the debug. So bang, 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 we have all our projects built and installed into C temp demo build VC6 bin. So let's try it out. This should print yes. Great. Now let's try um, to generate a 2005 project. So let's create another build directory called VC 2005. Configure. We'll select 2005. And again. Let's set the install prefix to be the same as the build directory. Click on configure again and generate. That's it. Let's open Visual Studio 2005 and drag the SLM. The same, you can see the two um, extra targets, all build and install. We're going to use batch build here, it's nicer. You can see the four different targets here. I'm going to select just debug and build. Bang, bang, bang. And we've compiled, linked, and installed our VC2005. Uh, executable into the bin directory. So let's try that. Great. That's it. Thank you for watching. Uh, for watching this video, I hope you enjoyed it. And on the next video, I'm going to show you some Linux IDs. Bye.